It's an yet another sad day for this county because we have lost another leader. This time not through an accident, we are told he, through some sudden illness. And for us it's just to condole with the family, to condole with the people of Rogoro. And uh, generally also as a government we would wish to pass our condolences to the county assembly of Nyeri through the speaker and the leadership of the house and to tell them that we as a government uh, share with them the pain that they are going through. And he was the chair of uh, the, the committee uh, for health, health services. And he was a person who was calm, collected, mature. A person who handled uh, things in a very composed manner. He went into cardiac arrest even when he was at Jamia Hospital. But we managed with the doctors and the specialists there to resuscitate him. And the decision was made to transfer him to somewhere where he will be able to get ICU care. Because what he needed was ICU care because of his critical condition. So they managed to transfer him here. When he came here, we received him in a, also in a very critical condition. He managed to have our specialists on board. Unfortunately, when he came, all we could do at that time was resuscitation because his, his heart was not uh, able to beat well. So we gave him all the medication, we did all the protocols that we do for resuscitation. But unfortunately, even after doing all that, we were not able to, to save him. 